I made myself very clear that I had absolutely no contact with this client. I have no inside information. I referred only to the um, information published in the newspaper, as did every other um, senator who spoke on the matter. Lord Chimidial Ramlal says the suggestions by some that she may have been compromised is simply not practical, and she does not believe it is relevant to the matter at hand. I have worked on and will work on in the future because Mr. Ram Logan from time to time will ask me to come in on a particular matter as his junior counsel. Mr. Ram Logan is also um, handling a lot of work that has a, a political slant to it on behalf of the UNC or local government matter that we had to, to fight to get elections held. I was involved in that matter obviously because I am a member of the UNC and part of the parliamentary arm of the UNC. So is it that I will never speak in the Senate again on anything because I was on Ram Logan for a period of time at his firm and because I continue to work with him on several matters? But it's a, it's a matter reported today in the newspaper where it was my client and I ended up briefing Mr. Ram Logan because we work together. Um, I don't see what that has to do with anything. The senator says there is a handful of senior counsels who practice public law, and if the Auditor General engages Freedom Law Chambers, it is her constitutional right to do so. She says the government has bigger things to worry about. The very first time I stood up in the Senate to speak, I was interrupted within the first five minutes by Faris al Rawi, who started to make back an aisle about, you know, the law firm and that I work with Mr. Ram Logan and so on and so forth. Look, at the end of the day, people have a constitutional right to choose who they want. Who should the Auditor General go to? One of the lawyers who are handpicked by the Attorney General and receive millions of dollars in briefs every year from him? I mean, there's only a handful of senior, senior counsel in this country who practice public law, right? Mr. Ram Logan is one of them. If it is the uh, Auditor General chooses to go to that person, um, I, I don't know that that should affect the government's ability to defend yes. themselves if they can. The senator expressed concern over some of the statements being made in the parliament about the Auditor General. I find it condescending and I find it very disrespectful to someone yeah. who holds very, you know, such high constitutional office. Um, and, you know, they should cease and desist from that. And as I say, focus on the real issue here. Senator Lachmidial Ramlal says an independent investigation into this matter should include the Treasury and the Central Bank. Aksha Galston, TV6 News.